Hello everyone, my name is Luca Morgantini and I work for the Department of Virology at the University of Illinois at Chicago. I do not have any financial interests or relationships to disclose. The International Prostate Symptom Score, also called IPSS, is a self-completed questionnaire that is commonly used in clinical practice to evaluate the severity of lower urinary tract symptoms attributable to benign prostatic enlargement. Over the past decades, the overall literacy in the United States has slowly but steadily declined. In fact, one of the problems that clinicians have with the IPSS is that patients may not fully understand the questions and inaccurate responses may decrease the usefulness of this questionnaire. The objective of this study was to develop a simplified version of the IPSS, which maintained the same framework of the original questionnaire with wording tailored to the literacy level of the present-day elderly male population of the United States. The original IPSS has a calculated readability level at 8th grade, while according to the most recent statistics, 21% of the adults in the United States read below a 5th grade level. The simplified IPSS has a calculated readability at the 4th, 5th grade level, and theoretically the majority of the English-speaking adult population should be able to understand it. We simplify the language in general. To state a few examples, we remove the over the past month statement, in each question and instead included the phrase in the past 30 days only once at the beginning of the questionnaire pertaining to all questions. We also replaced higher literacy words with a relatively simple counterpart. For instance, words like urination, postpone or strain were substituted with P, hold in and push. The quality of life question was also simplified. From the long-winded how would you feel if you had to live with your urinary condition just the way it is now not better, not worse, for the rest of your life? With a simple and more direct, how do you feel about your pain? The answer options were also converted into more easily understandable statements. In particular, we adopted a six points Likert scale that went from not at all to almost always, exactly as the original IPSS, but with shorter and silver wording. For example, almost never replaced less than one time in five. The same simplification process was also applied for the Spanish version of the IPSS, given the high prevalence of the Spanish-speaking population in the United States. We also tested our questionnaire. In male patients aged 65 or older were presented to our clinic due to lower urinary tract symptoms in October 2019. A total of 18 patients agreed to participate in the study and were randomly assigned to complete one questionnaire before the visit and one afterwards. 13 completed it in English and 5 in Spanish. An additional question was added at the end to ask about the difficulty they experienced in completing each questionnaire. On average, respondents found that the simplified IPSS to be easier to understand than the original IPSS. These results were evident both for the English and the Spanish versions. Average scores addressing incomplete emptying in both questionnaires were similar. However, mean scores calculated for the other lower urinary tract symptoms were consistently higher in the simplified IPSS. Supportive of these findings mean quality of life scores of the simplified IPSS was one and a half points worse than what recorded with the original IPSS. Additionally, three participants needed help to complete the IPSS, while none required assistance for the simplified one. In conclusion, the readability level of the simplified IPSS is better aligned than the original IPSS to the literacy level of the target population. We believe that this will allow for better identification of symptom severity and their impact on quality of life. These preliminary results require further testing in larger cohorts of patients in order to better understand the clinical utility and potential advantages of the simplified APSS. For those of you who are interested in this project, please do not hesitate to contact me. You can also scan these two QR codes to download the English and the Spanish version of the simplified APSS. Thank you for your attention and I'm happy to answer any of your questions.